There is so much information out there about photography and videography, about gears, about techniques, about everything that we have to learn, right? That it's easy to get lost along the way and forget about the most important thing. In today's video, I want to share with you the only thing that I think is important to keep in mind when you do photography and when you want to improve. Hi, my name is Thierry Gibraltar, and like you, I am on a journey to learn photography and videography and get better at it. I've started about a year, a, year, a bit more than a year now, a year ago, and I just picked up my first camera, the X-T4, and starting to shoot whatever I could find, whether it was in the street, portraits, food, products, whatever. I tried to shoot and shoot and learn and learn and apply and apply. I focused on improving my skills for a year, but I believe that there is one important thing that took me a while to understand. And in today's video, I wanna share that with you. And by the way, I'm curious, how long have you been shooting for? Let me know in the comments. So often when you start photography, the only thing that you have in mind is that, oh, I need to have the right settings, I need to have the right gear, I need to have, um, I need to learn this specific technique and apply it to my particular shoot that I have in front of me, right? So, oh, okay, what's my aperture? What's, what is my, oh, is, is my light set correctly, etc. But by doing so, I think we forget the most important thing about photography, which is basically the subject in front of you. Whether it's a person, whether it's a product, food, etc. First thing, the first thing that you should care about is your subject. See, and myself, I'm the first guilty of that. I was so focused on learning about aperture, about the right exposure, about sound, about light, etc. that I often forgot about how to make my subject look as good as possible. Started by the technical aspect of photography might get you good results, might get you better at what you do, but it should not be the starting point. Thinking first about your subject, thinking first about what kind of subject you're dealing with, what are the specificities of the subject, and then moving to the technical aspect of photography to be able to emphasize those characteristics and bring them out is, I believe, the better way to go. If you only get one point out of this video, I would say that photography is not about you. It's about what's on the other side of the lens. Start with the person or subject on the other side of the lens and then think about how your gears, your skill, your light, can make them look better. If you work with a model, maybe discuss with that model and understand what she's or he is about, what that person like about himself or herself. If you work with a product, try to understand what the creators of the product meant for it. Do not randomly place the product in the way that you would like to see it, but maybe try to bring the best out of the product from the creator's eyes. From the moment you understand the specificities of the subject, that's when you should start thinking about the technical aspect and not the opposite. That's for me the number one rule now that I, well, I live by uh, when it comes to photography. First, understanding my subject, what they like, what they don't like, what kind of characteristic or specificities they have and how I can bring that. Use my camera, use my gear, use my light to bring that up. So I invite you basically to do the same next time you shoot. Don't focus on yourself and focus on your subject. And of course, keep learning, stay curious. Keep learning new techniques, new tricks, uh, new things about gears because that's important. But ultimately, don't forget that everything that you learn is a tool and is not the end goal. So I hope that this, this video was helpful to you. And if it was, uh, please consider to leave a like, a comment and subscribe to the channel. I will keep trying bring, to bring more useful videos, I hope, uh, for well beginners in photography and not so beginners and if you want to see more videos consider to subscribe to the channel i'll see you in the next video and cheers guys